In today's video, I will show you how to use Focus Stable Diffusion Free Tool to change facial expressions and emotions in your images. You can create different emotions with your images. Follow the tutorials and don't miss the tips. First, I want to create an image to use as the source image and get its seed number. We need seed number to have more consistency. I use this image pose. Here, upload your image. Select Pyrocanny and increase the stop at parameter. Write your prompt. I use Focus Photograph Style. Use a style like this and choose No More for better control over the text prompt. For the base model, I use the default model. Based on your desired output, choose Realistic Models from Civit AI. Select the aspect ratio based on the image that you want to use its pose. If your selected aspect ratio is not suitable, you may lose some parts of your image. Choose one of these images, and if you are not satisfied with the result, generate more images. When you select an image, click History Log to see the seed number. I selected the first image, so I copy the seed number from here. Uncheck Random and paste the seed number here. Click on Upscale or Variation tab. Upload the source image here. We use Subtle Variation to redefine the source image based on the prompt that we add. Write the text prompt that you created the image with. In the text prompt, add the facial expression that you want to see in the result. As in the previous section, I use Focus Photograph Style. Don't select more styles. You can use No Style. Note that you should use the model that you created the image with. Changing the model can cause a difference between the results and source image. If you want better results, try using more words to better describe what you want. When you use Pyrocanny, you can change your image pose, not facial expressions. With image prompt and face swap combined with text prompt, I couldn't get proper results for any source image. Sometimes the results are good and sometimes not. I want to test another expression, but this time I want to add weight to the part of the text prompt that I want to have more effect. To add weight for a special part, hold the control key on your keyboard and press the up arrow to increase the number. You can decrease the value by pressing the down key. Don't use a high value. It can make strange results. I mostly use 1.2 or 1.3 depending on what I want. I don't use style, and I use the previous seed number. If you are not satisfied with the result, use more words, and you can use wait for some parts. You can edit your image within paint, Use Improve Method. Improve skin, eyes, hair, or any part that you want to make it better. Ask your questions in the comment and share your experience of using this tool with us. Thanks for watching.